Welcome into Wager Talk TV. I am Drew Martin, joined by Rocky Atkinson and Mid Major Matt at SportsMemo.com. We got NFL Sunday action here, Rocky. We got the Cleveland Browns hosting the Houston Texans here, 44 and a half being the total in Cleveland, with uh, the Browns laying three at home. Uh, what are your thoughts here with the Browns and the Texans on Sunday? Well, looking at the line here, I have this game closer to a pick 'em. Uh, giving a little value to Houston, but not a huge amount. So I'm going to stay away from the side in this game with just a lean to the Texans. I do want to note that Houston is 5-0 and against the spread the last five meetings in this series. Just seems like it's time for Deshaun Watson to lead his team to a victory. Maybe a small lean to Houston. While I'm not interested a whole lot in the side here, I am interested in the total in this one. Um, total opened up at uh, – 55 and a half and dropped to 53 at this point. Uh, public is betting the over, however. So it appears smart under here. I move off butter the little of the past three games as they are scoring only 16.7 points per game. Baker may questionable as of right now for this game uh, due to the COVID-19 protocol. The under is 33 and 13. The last game sleep Cleveland is installed as a hybrid of three points or less. The under is 12 and 2 the last 14 games for Houston when they fought for their opponent off a straight up favorite loss. The under has cashed eight out of the last 10 meetings overall in this series. I'm going to lean to the under in this game. All right, looking towards the under from Rocky. We got uh, Matt Josephs here, sportsmemo.com, Houston at Cleveland, buddy. What are you thinking? Well, I mean, I think there's a couple of things to consider. Obviously, we don't know. We assume that Baker Mayfield's going to play in this game, and if he doesn't, that means Case Keenum comes in. There may actually be value on the Browns if Case Keenum becomes the quarterback because he does work. He has worked with uh, Kevin Stefanski in the past, and I might actually lean to Cleveland if he is the quarterback. But we figure Baker's going to be in. The other thing is Nick Chubb figures that he's going to play. They activated his 21-day practice window as he comes off, and when you put Chubb and Hunt out there combined as a running game, that makes them really good here, and they don't have to rely on, on the quarterback as much. Houston can't stop the run very much because uh, they just struggle with it up front. Um, you know, Deshaun Watson is a guy that's done a lot of good things here. He's getting uh, good connections with Fuller and Cooks at uh, quarterback and wide receiver here. I think this will be an interesting game, but of course, any sort of pick here relies on uh, Baker Mayfield coming in. So if Baker Mayfield plays, this is probably a stay away for me. If, if Case Keenum is the starter, I actually think there will be some value with Cleveland here on Sunday against the Texans. In, in mid-major match, just real quick, uh, Case Keenum coming in. I mean, we all remember his college days lighting it up, but you actually think that uh, maybe you would power rank the the Cleveland Browns higher with him taking snaps or just after the market move, um, which would likely happen if, if, if Baker Mayfield was uh, the starting quarterback? Yeah, I think it would be after the, the the move, presumably, because Case Keenum's been in this system. He was with Stefanski in Minnesota, and he's got a really good running game, so they don't need him to do okay. very much. I'm not high on Baker Mayfield, so therefore, you know, I've not been high on the Browns as a team, and mostly because of Baker Mayfield and, 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 the, and the guys in that huddle there, but... To me, Case Keenum would represent some good value. But, I'm, I mean, we're going to guess that Baker Mayfield's going to play, and so it will be just a pass for me. Okay, good stuff from Matt Josephs and Rocky Atkinson at SportsMemo.com. Guys, go check them out. Also, remember, it's $2 Tuesday each and every Tuesday at WagerTalk and SportsMemo.com. The hottest handicappers, top play, discounted to just $2 at both WagerTalk and SportsMemo.com.